and dance here with my daughter Evelyn. I'm going to show you what, roughly what happens in one of my primary classes today. I'm not going to show you the whole class but there's a little snippet that you'll get to, to get to try out. Um, so this is actually really good for if you're at home, stuck at home and you can't get out and you're looking for a way to, for your kids to just burn a little bit of energy. If you're looking to find out more about my classes, my classes hopefully after summer will be starting back. Um, and if you just look up Ascend Dance Dundee or ascenddance.co.uk, you'll find a bit more about my classes. So we're just going to get started. So Evie's going to stand next to me and we're just going to do a little bit of a warm up. So we're going to start by just putting our feet next to each other and we're going to start by bending our knees and just doing a little bit of a bounce. We're starting with the bounce of our knees. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Then we're going to do arm swishes over our head. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then I think what we'll do is we'll add in a jump. Just a little one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So turning round, going from low to high and balance. And then we'll do it again. Mainly because we don't have too much space. If you're at home, you're pushing the sofa out of the way. Or you're trying to find somewhere to do this in this space that's very small. So we're trying to keep it relatively on the spot for you today. Are you ready? Off we go and bouncing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Reaching. Two, three, five, six, seven. Little bounces. One, two, three, four, five, six. Go to high. Go. All the way to high. Again. Little bounces. sits down first she's going to hold her standing up yeah. see can't get away with that when you've got a teacher for a mum what do you do pinchy pinchy crab hands holding that skirt out then what do you do one knee then the other knee she's sitting on her bottom bottom on the floor let's go all the way around and crisscross applesauce we're going to do the same let me just do my music with me <laughs> sitting on the knee on knee bottom all the way around crisscross applesauce we're going to do a little arm exercise so we're going to start by tickle, tickle, tickling the floor. We want to not have a grumpy back, so show me what a grumpy back and a grumpy face looks like, Evie. Oh, that's a really good grumpy face. <laughs> show me what a happy back is and a happy face looks like. Beautiful. She's going to look... Oh, let's write a little secret message on her hands first. Should we write a little secret message? You can tell me what the secret message is at the end. We're going to look at one hand, and it's not too high. It's in front of her tummy button. We're looking at her secret message, and we put it back. Then we're going to look at our other hand, Looking at a secret message and put it back. Then we're going to look at both our secret messages together. Maybe you can join them together to decipher what it's going to be. It's not a squished message, it's a nice round message. That's it, so pulling that out a little bit. We're going to lift that up and then we're going to burst our bubble so we go pop and down. Now I have to see that pop at the top. That's it, good. We're going to look up at our wing and put it down because we're a beautiful detective swan. Yes? Mm -hmm. So we're looking for a secret message, but we're swans still. Looking up our other hand and down. And then we'll do the same thing again. So start with your hands tickling the floor, sitting up nice and tall. Think about holding everything nice and tall, shoulders down and back. Ready? Slowly lifting the 
legs out in front of you, pointing right to the end and sitting up nice and tall. Just put your hands on your knees just now. We're going to lift our toes up, then our feet, then our feet go down, and then our toes. Again, toes, feet, feet, toes, toes, feet, feet, toes, and then we're going to act like we're really, really cold and do a big shiver. And hug it in, and then warm up. Okay, let's try that with the music. Sitting up nice and tall, off we go. Nice and tall, and her back nice and straight. Ready? we're going to do. Bend for two, then straighten for two. Bend for two, then straighten for two. And now you want your knees to be over your toes. What do you not want to do, Evie? You tell me. Yep, yeah, so what do you pretend that you're in? Toaster machine. Yep, yeah, so we pretend that we're in a toaster and you're a flat piece of bread. You're not a bent piece of bread. So that when you go down, your bottom doesn't get burnt and your nose doesn't get burnt. Okay, then we're going to, so we do bend and straighten, bend and straighten. We're going to count to four and we're going to pretend we're bouncing our ball. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We then do the same thing, but we're going to do a bit of a jump this time. So we're going to do bend, then we're going to straighten and go up on our toes, straighten, bend and straighten. Then we're going to add our jumps. One, two, three, four. One. Two, three, four. Let's try it with the music. Find that first position. Standing up nice and tall. Nice and slow. Bend for two. Straighten for two. Thank you. 
going to just demonstrate a lovely big jump, okay? okay. So she's going to start with her feet. We'll do it parallel just now. And she's going to bend those knees so they're nice and squishy. Just bend those knees. Oh, we're in parallel though, so keep those knees together. Parallel. That's it, keep those knees together. And she's going to jump as high as she can, keeping those legs straight. And see if you can touch my hand. Off you go. Oh, she's too tall for this game. <laughs> right, she's going to do it in first position, but this time she's got to land in first position. Her knees have got to go apart. So obviously bend your knees apart. That's it, you've got to land in first position. Off you go. Did you land in first position? Maybe. <laughs> We're now going to do our points. Now I want you to imagine that you're in your garden and you're going to plant yourself some flowers. What type of flower are you going to do? Rose. A rose. I think I'm having a nice sunflower to cheer everyone up. So we're going to imagine that our dirt's in front of us and instead of using our tools, we're using our feet. So we're going to dig with our heels. Heel and in. Heel and in. And it's right in front of your nose. Now, when I put my heel forward, my toes are out. They're not all saggy. They're out. We do four of those. You're then going to take your seeds and you're going to plant four seeds. One, two, three, four. You're then going to cover them up with your toes. Cover it up. Cover it up. Way and put your water over it and then we do it again. Let's try it with the music. Bye-bye.